Hey what's going on guys, Turty Wurty here and welcome back to another Minecraft modding tutorial uh, for 1.12.2 In this video we are going to be going over uh, how to create custom stairs um, So I know I am doing some simple tutorials um, like this um, like stairs and slabs and I am going to be continuing that until I have done these basic little uh, tutorials so I'm going to be doing pressure plates, fences, fence gates um, all of that stuff buttons and all of it I'm going to be doing tutorials on all of that so uh, expect a few more of those and that is just because you know people uh, have been requesting it uh, funnily enough so I thought I might as well do them and then I'll continue back to world gen and we can get the my dimensions and stuff but first um, we got this tutorial so what you want to do is go ahead and register it in block in it just like we did with all our other blocks so public static final oh, messed up there block and you want to just call this um, your stairs so I'm going to do silver underscore stairs and that needs to equal a new block uh, I'm going to call it block stair base just like that and here obviously we want to go ahead and put the name um, so I'm going to put silver underscore stairs and then you want to add a second parameter now this is going to be the block that you want to use for the stairs um, so mine is going to be block init dot um, silver block dot get default state just like that now we're going to go ahead and create this block stair base so inside of blocks you want to create a new class and call this block stair base so I would advise only using a base if you're going to have a lot of stairs um, I know for my personal mod I, I am using a base because I, I'm going to have a lot of stairs um, but otherwise I wouldn't advise using a base um, as base classes are very much frowned upon um, and there will be a link in the description to a forum about why you shouldn't use base classes um, so yeah that's that will be in the description if you want to read on that um, but yeah so this class needs to go ahead and extend block stairs so stairs are actually reasonably simple um, it shouldn't be a long tutorial like the slabs because we don't actually have to write much out um, a lot of it because it's just mostly in the extended class or the super class I mean so the pram so the arguments you want to put here is a string name and I block state model state um, you can also go ahead and put creative tab, hardness, sound type. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that. So um, creative tab, is it creative tab, creative tabs tab, um, float hardness, um, float resistance. Um, sound type oh sound sound no. sound type sound um, and obviously you can go ahead and add anything else you want there um, you need to go ahead super off of model state as that is in the super class um, that's basically uh, our second parameter here so this is the um, default state of the block you want your stairs to be made of uh, then you need to set the unlocalized name to name set the registry name to name set the creative tab creative tab to tab 
uh, set the hardness, set hardness to hardness, set the resistance to resistance. Uh, you can set the harvest level as well. Um, so we can do string harvest level and int um, something. So we'll just set the sound type first. Sound type to sound. Um, what's this? Oh yes, because we must finish that. So let's go ahead and if we set the harvest level, yes, that's an int level. So if you do int level, then you can just declare all of this in your init class, which is much easier. Um, so actually, yeah, let's call that tool class. There we go. Then we need to go ahead and add this to block init dot block. So add it just like that. Then you need to go ahead and add it to item in it. So item in it dot items dot add a new item block of this import item block dot set registry name. Oh, set registry name. Do this dot get registry name. Just like that. And now that's done. So now we can go ahead to block in it and add all of these um, other parameters. So let me just add arg arguments, I mean. Um, so the first one we set is creative tab. So we can obviously do tutorial mod dot tutorial mod tab. The next thing I believe was hardness. So mine is going to be... Um, What's hardness of iron? I think it's 15.0F, but I might be wrong. Um, resistance is 30. I know that for a fact. No, actually, I don't know that for a fact, but I'm pretty sure. Um, sound type is just going to be sound type dot iron for mine. Uh, no, it's sound type dot metal. Yep, just like that. Then the harvest level, uh, or the tool class as it's called, um, is going to want to be pickaxe. And I'm going to make it so. Uh, one second, let me just check what Minecraft values are. So, two. I want it to be mine more of. Uh, wait, no. What's stone? Uh, stone is one so I want it to be able to be mineable with stone and above so that is that that's actually all there is for the Java code um, so yeah now the block states are a bit bigger um, so you will have to copy those from the description um, my github will be in the description um, alternatively I will put separate links to each uh, JSON in the description um, if I remember that is because sometimes I don't but I should do so we're just gonna copy candy cane um, and we're going to rename it to um, silver underscore stairs just like that we're gonna delete everything inside and if you go to the description, the one which will be named block state, um, block state silver stairs. Um, I need to go ahead and change the mod ID because obviously this is from my own mod, um, and that's not going to work here. So just replace all. Uh, if you're wondering how I get this find replace thing up, I I do Control F, and that just brings it up. Uh, at the top you type in what you want to find and uh, what you want to replace um, and the bottom is what you want to replace it with so I'm going to place cherry with silver there you go 
now you can see there is three um three different block models you will need so that is silver underscore stairs silver underscore outer underscore stairs and silver underscore inner underscore stairs so if we now go into our uh, models block we can copy candy cane again because why not um, and we're going to call the first one silver underscore stairs then we're going to copy silver stairs because it's just easier and we're going to instead rename this one inner so silver underscore inner underscore stairs and then paste it again and call it silver underscore outer underscore stairs so all of these will be in the description um, so you just want to delete everything inside in all of them so just like that now we have three empty uh, block states first we're going to do normal silver underscore stairs um, so I'm just going to grab these um, I'm going to do replace again so replace and then um, cherry I'm going to replace and it's not going to be underscore planks it's going to be underscore block so let's just replace those okay and let me just run next to cherry planks there we go that's that one then inner stairs so these are actually pretty simple because they come from the parent of um, the vanilla uh, the vanilla block state of inner stairs or the vanilla block model I mean so now you can just go ahead and do the same thing again so nope that's that's wrong <sighs> my mod ID is not silver if it was I would be extremely concerned so there we go and then you want to go ahead and replace cherry planks with silver underscore block not like that there we go if that's save then you can close that now we have the outer stairs so just paste that in um, and we're going to replace it again of course place there you go so that is the block model and the block state done now we have the item model um, so obviously this is just a normal um, block item model so item block model I suppose um, so you want to call it just silver underscore stairs and then find it there it is uh, I'm just going to replace everything inside because I already have the JSON uh, this JSON won't be in the description because um, we used to have this one um, anyways but it is in my github if you don't have it so it's fine cherry 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 yep and then replace with silver there we go and that is all of the Jasons now we're just going to go ahead and go into the lang and at blocks we're going to do tile dot silver underscore stairs dot name is equal to silver stairs give that a save and that is all of your code done so now I'm going to go ahead and run the game uh, if you by the way if you do get the selection cannot be launched there are no recent launches if you go up to here down the arrow and click run configurations and you click the clients click run then that will fix that um, just in case you ever have that so I'll see you guys in the game oh oopsies so guys we just got into the game if we go into our creative tab and um, we see we have silver stairs just like this so you just place them down and they connect just like that there you go and obviously you would want to test upside down so one second let me grab uh, actually I didn't really need to do that but upside down there you go like that 
voila now you have um, fully working stairs now some people do query that if you leave the game this changes um, just like the slabs so we're just gonna test that so you leave the game load back into the world and the stairs should be uh, all in the same place um, just like that so we got no no errors at all so now obviously we got stairs and slabs it's pretty neat oh lag I don't know what that was for but now you can just do something like this oh what the hell what the hell whoa glitchy glitchy there we go it's really glitchy actually voila now you have a nice thing which you could waterlog if it was um if it was 1.14 or 1.13 but uh it's not so you can't um so anyway guys if you did enjoy this tutorial please do be sure to smash your face into that like button and subscribe if you really enjoyed please do be sure to share it and yeah i will see you guys in the next video goodbye